Hey everyone, my name is Nolan. Welcome back to another episode of RL Craft. And if you guys can't tell, did make a little bit of progress off camera. Uh, it would have just been boring. You guys have like been uh, telling me, or at least one dude, I, I think it was uh, Clutcher was saying like, can't really watch RL, RL Craft. And I, I don't blame you, it's pretty slow, at least for the first couple episodes. So I wanted to start making these a little bit more fast paced and entertaining to watch. Um, so yeah, we're actually gonna like, do that in this video we made some progress off camera as you guys can tell by this map here here's some exploring i did found a couple of waystones and this one here is at a really really decked out freaking village with giant walls the problem is there is a dragon on th that that like has a nest in the center of the village and it's freaking crazy so we might go check that out but i'm not going to bring any of my stuff with me if i do the goal for this episode is to get an XP tome. So off camera, uh, I did a lot of exploring like I said, and it was very good for loot. In fact, I don't actually think I did any of my sorting uh, off camera, so I might do that in a quick cut. But yeah, look at all this loot I got from just exploring. No mining, no battle towers, no dungeons whatsoever. This was just exploring. I found diamonds in a chest, stacks of lapis blocks from from building roofs. We got uh, already some ingredients for making a rock saddle. Guys, we are freaking on top of it. I should have been exploring from day one because that's clearly the way to go. Actually, I need to leave that there. So yeah, uh, let me get some stuff sorted really quick and then we'll move on with the episode. Oh, actually really quick before I do, I also have enough knowledge, I believe, to spawn in a nymph, which if you guys have been following along with the last couple episodes, you would know that we need to spawn a nymph as soon as possible. That way we can start regenerating ourselves we don't need to rely on bandages uh or sleeping we can just respawn ourselves so that's basically what i've been trying to do is get enough knowledge by uh using this soul gazer on a okay yeah so that's full so we can actually spawn a nymph all i need to do is create a summoning staff but before i do that i'm going to get my inventory sorted so let's crank that out of the way all right guys that's all sorted now so let's uh also make another heart crystal so we can get our life up got enough crystals to make one now i think i had one in the last episode but i just didn't make one uh another thing guys that i don't actually really know what the best thing to do is is like getting food early game i've literally just been uh munching off of bread that i've been finding like from villages and stuff Actually, you know what? There's probably some bread over at that desert village, but yeah, that's basically what I've been doing this whole time. Okay, this one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, is there any wheat? Oh, there's a lot of wheat. Okay. <laughs> All right. Good to know. Let me get some food really quick. Okay, another thing that I wanted to say is if you guys have any experience at all when it comes to RL craft, uh, maybe you guys can let me know what you guys think the best uh, diamond weapons are to get. I've been using a stone sword just because it's what I found in a chest, so got it for free, thought might as well use it, so yeah, I've been using it. Uh, but yeah, okay, so really quick, I want to make a summoning staff so we can actually uh, spawn in our nymph when we need, and then yeah, we... Are gonna go find some ender pearls so we can make an XP tome because uh, I believe we only have three ender pearls, and if I make the summoning staff, we'll only have two. So then we'll need two more. Yeah, we'll need two more uh, ender pearls to make an XP tome. But an XP tome will be good because what happens is it allows you to store XP in a book up to 30 levels. So basically, just enough for enchanting. Okay, yeah. So summoning staff, I believe, is this. Yes. Summoning staff, that's so good, bro. We are so up right now. So yeah, I probably won't make any, like, uh, combat advancements in this video, but we are definitely going to be making, uh, some defensive advancements, uh, especially because, uh, we are on our way to level 16 defense, almost there. Uh, and that basically will allow me to use, uh, diamond armor. So, yeah, I thought about, uh, traveling through the desert because it's, uh, kind of winter now. It's like... What was it? Late autumn or something? Oh gosh, I need to go get my water back. But yeah, basically that means it's going to be cold everywhere else except in the desert. But looks like I'm still kind of in... I I'm still very hot in the desert. I, I don't know. Let's just try it. This could be a really bad idea, but let's just try it. We'll start... Uh, That's not the desert. Okay, this one is the desert. Uh, we'll start here. I guess let's just keep moving in a direction here. Let's keep my atlas here so we can keep track. I haven't been, I think, this way. We're going to go this way over this hill. But yeah, guys, I I don't know why I didn't just explore early on. Like, it's actually pretty efficient for getting not only loot, but at least a little bit of XP. See, am I, like, already about to start overheating? Like, that's honestly crazy. Ooh, yeah, and another thing I want to do is see if I can find a above-ground blaze spawner. That way I can get a heating coil. 
because uh, winter is kind of deadly. Not gonna lie. Luckily, I live right next to a desert, so like we shouldn't struggle too much. But yeah, okay. Let's get to this savanna biome here and see if we can cool down a little bit. Ooh, is that a village? <gasps> Ooh, isn't that like a really good structure? Oh, that thing is giant. That thing is freaking giant. So yeah, a lot of these structures are spawning in the sky. I think because uh, because I did like realistic terrain generation, so it's kind of broken. But yeah, whatever. We could like low key use this as a mob farm too, because like it's dark right there. I don't think I'm gonna go up there yet. Uh, just because I don't know if I'm prepared for that. Okay, I just looked it up. Looks like there's beacons in there, so we won't be able to utilize beacons for a while anyway, so I'll mark it on the map, but other than that, it's not really going to be too important right now. Oh yeah, we actually do kind of have mob spawning under here, which is kind of crazy. Whoa. Whoa, what is that? What is that? What? The guardian dragon? What is the guardian dragon? I'm going to look this up before I before I, oh, a village, yes, that's so good. Okay, I'm gonna look this up really quick. Okay, I'm not too sure what that is. However, I will say, when I was looking it up, there was a video that was like the Guardian Dragon, and it was like one of the final episodes of an RL Craft series. So, <laughs> this might be a little hard to kill. Like in my other series, uh, like Mason said, we didn't even finish it. Like, we beat the Ender Dragon and got really overpowered and stuff, but like, we weren't even like equipped for lost cities. Oh, another thing, guys, is uh, I found a uh, in my other world, I found a supreme sharpness five villager. Didn't realize how good. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. I wasn't even paying attention. I wasn't even paying attention to the fact that there's an alpha joust on me. Like what? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Okay, I'm not too worried now. Okay, let's not bring it to other jousts. I was too distracted with the fact that there is a dragon at this village. Like, come on, bro. Can I stop getting villages with dragons? Like, because it's just going to kill everything. And I need I need to check for books. I need to check for books, bro. Ugh, that's so annoying. Okay, well, I guess let's see if I can sneak into that village and use a waystone, but I might die. The poor villagers. The poor freaking villagers, bro. Oh my... Okay, let's see if I can sneak into this building on the right side. Since he is on the left side. Okay, I'm sneaking around using this structure. And we are going to get the waystone. I'm just going to dig through the structure so he doesn't see me. He doesn't see me? Hopefully not. Hopefully not. What was that sound? That, that did not sound good. I'm going to stay in here. Okay, haven't found the waystone yet, but there are some crates in that house that I just saw. That house right there. And crates are really good because they're like shulker boxes early game. But dude, he's right there, dude. The dragon is right there. This thing will like... Go for it. <gasps> okay. Okay, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Oh gosh. I see the shadow. <laughs> okay, he's right above me. How am I gonna get out of here? Uh, I could tunnel. It doesn't. It doesn't sound good up there. It does not sound good up there. I feel like a freaking mole rat right now, or like a gopher or something. Oh, we got a banshee. We got a banshee. We got a banshee. We got a banshee. Gosh dang it! This is not a spot you want to be fighting a banshee. I don't know where it is. Let me this way. Let me this way. No, no. Come on. I'm gonna die. I can't. I can't do anything. Why is there. Why is there a dude up there, too? Of course, bro. The good news is, though, if I come to these villages at night, the dragon might be sleeping. It's not. It's not sleeping. He's not sleeping. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, that villager's dead. Oh, that that villager's so dead. Oh, oh. Oh no. Oh no, what happened?
Okay. Oh, you you got to be kidding me. You you've got to be kidding me. Got him. Jeez, that took way too long. I I really want to find this waystone. I don't know where the waystone is. Oh, there's the waystone. Okay, that's good. That's good. Oh, don't come this way. Okay, 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 okay. Going in, going in, going in. Mark it. Go back here. Dude, why are there banshees? It's freaking midday. Okay. Okay, at least now I Ugh, at least I wasn't freaking underground, bro. Ooh, another crate? Oh, heck yeah, heck yeah. Oh, another crate. No! You gotta be kidding me. My guy does not see me. My guy does not see me. Okay, now I can actually use the nymph. Okay, so here's what I want to do. This guy here. Why can't I summon this guy? I thought I I need 25 more guys. I thought I had enough. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm going to go find an ocean or a water biome right now so I can summon one. All right, I'm just going to make a bolt for it. This way, this way, this way. This way. What have I done? Oh, I hear a Gru. I hear a Gru. A Gru, I guess, isn't actually bad because we can get Ender Pearls, but they are kind of deadly. <gasps> Dude, this thing looks level five, but it's probably level four. Nah, bro. Is this freaking level five? Is this freaking level five? No way. Oh! 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 No, no way, no way. Isn't this really good? Isn't this freaking really good? Yeah, yeah, the fire dragon's eye. Oh my gosh. Fire resistance, night vision. Okay, it's it's expensive. <laughs> it's, it's definitely expensive, but... Dude. Oh my gosh. I, I have no reason to kill a stage 5 dragon now. I don't think you guys know just how freaking lucky that was. Oh my gosh. What the heck are those? What even are those? Like, actually, what even are those? Oh, hey. A villager camp. Nice. What do you sell? Advanced knockback. Okay. So that's probably really good. Advanced knockback 2 is in the mechs. Okay, I need to box you up right now. You are going to go in here. And you are going to be safe forever. There we go. Advanced knockback too. Okay, I'm gonna stand here and wait for a Django to spawn. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Put me down. Put me down, bruh. Ah! Go away. Go away. No. No. Why do I do two damage? Why do I do... Why do I do two damage? Oh! Why did I spawn here? Why did I spawn here? Gotta put this all on fast. Gotta put this all on fast. Oh, I already hear things coming. Okay. Okay. Okay, I have a little bit of armor on. I have a little bit of armor on. I can't pick up my chest plate! Ah! Where'd it go? It just attacked me once and left. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. What is hurting me? Jango. Jango. Ah. Come on. Got it. Got it. I don't know what just paralyzed me, bro. Okay. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on, run this way. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, 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 okay. Come on, come on. Oh, guys. Yes! No! Get him! Get him! What? From where? 
from where, guys? What? Oh, jeez. Well, I guess that night wasn't a complete failure. Well, I'm freezing. Time to go to the desert. Jeez, bro. See, like, this terrain generation is so cool. This is not a village. There are indeed monster spawners here. Okay. This is an easy uh, XP farm here. Not sure if this area is safe at all. Oh, great. We got an enchanted one. And I cornered myself. Dang it. Come on. Killed him before the thorns could. Okay. Okay. We're going out here. We are going out here. Forbidden fruit. What the heck is that? Oh, it's a bobble. Magic shielding. Huh. Grants immunity to hunger and nausea. Okay, well, I guess I might as well use it because I have, like, no bobbles. Is that a free blight kill that I'm seeing right there? Shall we find out? Just in case I die here. Might as well upgrade these foos. No! Ugh. Yes. Come on. Give me that XP. Give me that XP, bruh. Oh, oh, okay. All right. We know we know better to attack someone with thorns. Okay. All right. Let's get uh, let's get this dude in. Oh, I didn't really think that through actually. Okay. Heal me. Heal me first. Now I can kill you. No problem. So plenty of health. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, so much levels. So much levels. Yes. Unbreaking three. Ooh. Okay, well, that's only good when we have a disenchantment table, but, you know. Okay, get that to 16. Let's go. Our mining to 16 next. I feel like whatever that is, it's gonna kill me. Yeah, you're you're hostile. I know you're hostile. <laughs> I want to drop down there. I hear something. I don't like it. Maybe I can get inside that thing for protection. See a creeper? Okay. Oh, hey, an enchanted one. Okay, you don't you don't steal my thing, do you? It doesn't look like it. Okay, XP farm maybe? Don't blow up. Are you freaking kidding? <gasps> I actually pressed Q. Those dudes are stuck in there, luckily. Okay. Chest? Oh no, what have I done? Oh, I've really messed up. I've really messed up. No! No! <laughs> oh, guys, I'm so good at the game. I low-key don't even remember where I was. Dude, why is there just a diamond out here, bro? <laughs> okay. Getting all my stuff back. Please leave me alone. Please. All right, take two of this. I really, really, really want to check out these books, but I have a feeling you can see me. Okay, I don't know what it does. Okay, it just shoots slowly. You're deadly. Where did all these things come from? Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Guys. Guys. Another diamond. Just sitting here. Maybe I dropped that one earlier. Oops. Actually, I think I did now that I realize. Can I please get my stuff uninterrupted? Dude, why can I attack? Come on. Okay. Let's look at this. Fire aspect two. Yes, please. Fire aspect two. Okay. Punch two. I mean, I guess I'll take it. Diamond axe, I would like to take that, please. Uh, knockback too. I, dude, 
Where are these things coming from? I like how they can just hit me through the shield. Why aren't they giving me ender pearls? I need ender pearls. That's the one freaking thing I need, and they're not giving them to me. Whoa. Nice. That's that's awesome. Just open the crate. Okay. Okay, this darkling. Holy crap. I hit it once. I got one shot off before it killed me. I, I'm not even ready for this dungeon. This dungeon isn't even, like, hard. Okay, you see me. You freaking see me, bro. I could just try to drop down on top of that uh, cage and loot it. <laughs> I think I'm going to try that. Okay, right on top of it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. I don't think there's any way this TNT can go off. Okay, grand reveal. Oh, okay, we're good. We are good. Diamond block. Yo. <laughs> Yo. All right. Just got to go to that one there. Oh, there's Gru's. There are Gru's. Let's just go loot that one and get the heck out of here, bro. Okay. TNT broken. Let's go. Diamond helmet, splash potion, and night vision. All pretty good stuff. All right. <laughs> let's, let's just get out of here. I'm done. Still haven't added another ender pearl to my net worth. This... This is a good idea. Oh, he can hit me. And he hit me for three hearts on my leg. That's crazy. What the range? Oh, wait. It's thorns. It's thorns. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, we are so up. We are so up. We're going to get uh, probably magic 12, 12, actually, so I can use an enchantment table. Dude, so one hit did three hearts to my head of thorns damage. That's actually crazy. Guys, I have to be quiet, but I found blaze powder. In a village house. I didn't know that was possible. It's not a blaze rod, but I can make warm lining out of that. Okay, I'll stop doing ASMR now. Okay, I wasn't re gonna record because I was just gonna do a recap, but this is too good to be true. I just found a cobalt shield on the ground, just sitting here on the ground. What? And there's no, there's no Cyclops in here. I just get to loot this for free. Like, like what? Okay guys, so I just mentioned that I was going to do a recap and I thought I would do that because, uh, you know, we're, we're like 20-ish minutes into the episode. I edited a little bit and we still haven't got a freaking XP tome, but I did do a lot of exploring and my oh my, did I get super lucky I'm gonna be showing you guys something now here here's the thing I'm gonna throw on throw up a screenshot on screen really quick of how many times I died trying to get to this place because cockatrices are not okay they are so overpowered so I looked on the wiki on how you like counter them because basically what happens is if you look at a cockatrice, it will like beam you with a ray with like wither, nausea, uh, and then there's like a third debuff. I don't remember what it was, but it's super, super hard to kill these things because they just do so much damage. Uh, and so what I tried to do was like look away and just run around. But the problem is if you look away, they just run at you and one shot body shot you. Like it, it's insane how much damage these things do. And on the wiki, it doesn't bother to tell you that, oh no, no, they, they one shot. It says they do two and a half hearts. Yeah, no, with full iron armor and uh, the amount of life crystals I have, like you guys can see all my head, body, everything has four hearts. I still get one shot by those things. And so it was not fun trying to get over here. But yeah, so we got some villagers in here for trading. But here's what I want to show you guys. The grand prize of exploring. We have the best villager, one of the best villagers for trading with advanced mending this is so good last time we played rl craft me and mason we found regular mending for 26 emeralds this is advanced mending for 18 that's so good so basically that means in between episodes i can get some enchantment stuff set up and we can start actually getting good weapons with enchantments now uh because now i have mending and now i don't have to be worried about losing a uh, 
losing my stuff or like just having it break but yeah like i said at the beginning of the episode you guys have to let me know which weapons i need to go with uh so yeah but first before we can even enchant it all we need to get an xp dome so that's basically what i'm going to be trying to do like i've been trying to do this whole episode get two more freaking ender pearls oh also i think over here i have a dragon den question mark because basically when i walked by this area there's just a bunch of auras on the ground with like burnt stuff and I'm like, oh yeah, that, that's got to be a dragon's den. Uh, and then I went back there recently, and there was just a level 5 dragon flying around. So, yeah, that's definitely a level 5 dragon area. I'm going to try avoiding that at all costs, because uh, a level 5 dragon is like end game, end game. In fact, what enchantment is even there? Double jump. Okay. Might end up needing that, but probably not for a while. Oh, hey. Will this kill me if I open it? Nice try. Nice try, game. Haha. <laughs> I found another uh, dragon skeleton here. I'll mark it on the map, but I actually, you know what? Let's just collect all the stuff. Might as well. Level four. Dang, that's pretty good. I want to see if I can kill this Cyclops. I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but if I can, that'd be great because I think that that's what, like, dropped the Cobalt Shield. And so these guys might actually give really good loot. Killed it. And. Yeah, no, didn't. Didn't drop anything noteworthy, so I actually have no idea where that cobalt shield came from. I must have just gotten really lucky. What? I just realized I don't actually have a chest plate. Guys, you guys don't even know. That looks really deadly. Cross necklace! Oh, that's so good. Nope, I'm leaving here. What? Oh. Dog. I wanted to go in here to see, like, if it's going to be safe enough to, like, maybe get some ender pearls. Oh my gosh. An enderman spawner. Okay. Alright. How am I going to do this? Dang it. There's darklings. I might be screwed. Oh! Yes! Guys, 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 the string of luck continues. I got it. Okay, I need, I think I need one more. Oh. Yes. Okay, I am leaving right now and I'm getting an XP. Dude, dude, why, where did you come from? I'm not walking down these stairs. It gets my will. No. Let me die up here at least. There are so many reapers. I don't even I don't even know how you get out. Right there. Or right here. Okay. Okay. Got the banshee. Heal! Heal! Oh, that range was crazy. Holy cow. What the heck happened to this door? What? He's still alive. Oh, oh, got him. I cannot believe I survived that. Actually, I see a silix. I need that silix. Nope, I'm not sprinting. You don't see me sprinting. <laughs> Those things really, really try to get you to attack them. I need to kill these guys for their meat, remember? So I can uh, tame a rock. There's two of them. Ooh. They also drop lapis, but lapis isn't really something I need anymore. I go home. I go home now. All right, let me grab these ender pearls. Let me grab a book. And it's not saying I can craft it on here, but XP tome. Let's go. All right, guys, even though I died a lot in this episode, overall, it was successful. So thank you guys all for watching. Uh, in the next video, we're going to start getting some enchantments and getting some really good gear. Uh, so you guys will have to let me know, again, what weapon I should go with. You know, should I do like diamond nunchucks? Should I do a diamond pike? I'm not really too sure. In between episodes, I'll try and get uh, some more ender pearls maybe and maybe some more XP tomes so we could be as efficient as possible with uh, enchantments. So yeah, thank you guys all for watching again and I hope to see you guys all in the next video. Bye-bye. Ooh, I look sick with the cross necklace. Heck yeah.